Hello YouTube, this is my queen's eye back with another video, back with another message. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for all of the support, all of the likes, comments, shares, and subscribes is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. A lot of you are in this <laughs> in this real happy energy. Sometimes you may not feel like it, but you are. You are. Time to go and buy the book with the fates at the bottom. <clears throat> A lot of you could be feeling because you've done things by the book, you've done things in the correct order, whether somebody else thought it was too slow or not. It has really put you in a in a position where if it's small things that even try to provoke you or bother you, it's like you say whatever it is real quick though and then you letting it go time to go for some of you it's about to be something that you say one last time to somebody damn i just heard the worst goodbye could mean the best hello Take it how it resonates. For some of you, it's somebody that didn't do something by the book, though. And they have to go. Deep knowing. For some of you, you could have already felt. <laughs> you could have already felt this here. Yeah. Orphaned. Let me get my prayer in. Loving ancestors of my highest good, my highest light, my highest frequency. Please help me to channel these messages clear and concise with truth and clarity. Please block any and all negative interference during this message. Please return to sender tenfold. Thank you. Somebody know it too. Like I said, it could be the smallest little thing they want you to react to. Sometimes you will, and uh, most times it's like you're not. Because at the end of the day, you already know that somebody's about to be left out here. Disappointment <laughs> is, is here for somebody, and they know it. While you're getting blessed with a loyal heart <laughs> that's going to bring peace into your life. Somebody's going through a spiritual awakening too. Or they have. Take it how it resonates. Somebody, this is giving me like connecting with their emotions here. Somebody's going through a spiritual awakening. Yeah, five of pentacles with the five of swords. You've been loyal to somebody or something for too long here. What's this orphan here? A lot of you are pulling your energy back too. Somebody could feel like they, they are that they are draining you, but it's just you pulling your energy back. Like you're not giving something as much energy as you were before. And that's like a deep 
gut punch to somebody here with this deep knowing with the orphan. It's like they know. Let me try and see if I can do this. Let me see if I say this to this person, what they going, how they going to react. And a lot of you are just looking like, damn, you still on that bullshit? <laughs> like, like you haven't grown yet, but somebody is, they are, they are about to go through a spiritual awakening here. Because you're the empress here with the high priestess here. Oh, we, the sun and the moon. Page of Cups, Ten of Wands, Queen of Cups. Somebody want to come and apologize to you. Or they wanted to. But it's like, it's too late. Somebody had ample enough time to get something right. And it's like, now they going to have to go through something on their own. This spiritual awakening. But everybody goes through that alone. For the most part. And for the, the loyal hearts here, the ones that have gone through an awakening already, they're in this blessed and peace, peace energy here. Somebody just thought everything was about hidden motives, secrets. But the only way to really heal is to actually bring that shit up. <laughs> it's really to get to the core of it. And, and and somebody, you or whoever else, only you can determine what that is because you are the individual that's experiencing it. Shit is kind of making me wonder, like, if somebody going through something and you say something like, you know, I can imagine... Right, because sometimes I find myself saying that to people, but it depends on what the conversation is, too. But for some of you with this person, whatever, however they have to address their their inner shit, a lot of you can't imagine. <laughs> a lot of you can't imagine. Like, this is really just given that you have already ascended here. Like, somebody, they are not able to reach you. They're not able to penetrate you. Because you've bought whatever was, whatever was, whatever deep feelings that you had. Of maybe not being happy or being unseen or something like that. You've grown from that. You've grown from that. And it's bringing peace and blessings in your life here. And somebody missed out. Somebody did not want to do something by the book. They felt like it was going to be their way all the way to the end. Okay, until they really got to sit the fuck down and, and, and be in touch with their emotions here. And I'm, listen, Page of Cups with this Nine of Swords and the Nine of Wands here. They going to have to go through it. If somebody is really still out here saying that they don't have no no uh, childhood trauma that they need to heal from, they're fucking lying. <laughs> they're lying. 
Because that's the purpose of it. Even though we don't understand it as a child. But when you become an adult, that's your responsibility. <laughs> to figure that shit out. To illuminate it. Check yourself. And a lot of you have done that. People don't like being checked, but they won't check themselves. That's why they get checked. Because they don't check themselves. Why am I acting like an asshole? Even though I really know deep down inside with this deep knowing that I left this individual out in the cold. <laughs> Even though I know this empress high priestess didn't do shit to me. Shit, high priestess out here twice. Somebody thought they was going to block your intuition with you not knowing who you are here. Always being by yourself. But even if you are by yourself, you're fucking happy. This is a codependent motherfucker here. Nine of Swords with the Justice here. King of Swords. Nine of Pentacles. Three of Cups. Somebody Yeah, this nine of swords, that's that dark night of the soul. And for somebody or for some of you, you have somebody around you or in your energy that's getting ready to go through the dark night of the soul dealing with the justice system here. Like something's going to be on record about this individual. And it's not going to be pretty. <laughs> it's not going to be pretty. For some of you, if this is a past, an ex-lover here or ex-partner, husband, whatever... Something happened in your relationship in the past and you were being nudged. Like that was your intuition. High priest is out here twice. That was your intuition telling you that you needed to leave this person alone. <laughs> Ace of cups. Three of cups. You was being nudged to leave somebody alone. And it was because that this person had hidden motives, hidden agendas to gain some kind of abundance or happiness off of you. Like somebody just wanted to be around you to be happy. But you can't do that shit. And that was that's gonna be a part of this person's ascension. They're they're awakening here. Somebody's too fucking codependent. See, this person not listening to their intuition got them in a bunch of shit here. <laughs> For some of you, this person is sick here with this uh with this four of swords. It could they could be having like a stomach ulcer or something going on with their eyes. Four of cups. Somebody may become blonde or is blonde. <clears throat> There's some kind of sickness that this person has and they were trying to give it to you. Because this orphan too is the Five of Pentacles energy. What else here? And see, the more you awaken, the more you ascend it, the more you ascend it, it's like, oh, snap. <laughs> Wait a minute. This why I always feel like this around this person. Mm -hmm. 
somebody not listening to their intuition <clears throat> and wanting you to not listen to your intuition, you can see the difference. <laughs> Deep knowing orphan, high priestess, empress, son. Somebody really rejected a fucking blessing here. We got the emperor with the six of cups with the world here. For some of you, this your masculine that, that went through this awakening here. Damn, the tower. It's a tower coming. Whoever in this low vibrational energy, this deep knowing with this orphan out here, they still waiting on something to to be to be hard or overbearing for you. For some of you, it's your money here. This this is why this person is not. They're not going to be blessed here. But you, Tower, the fool with the lovers here. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Somebody making a plan. They're trying to come up with a plan. Or whatever the plan that the that, that devil energy, the enemy was trying to conjure up. <laughs> that shit blew up in their face. As it always do. And a lot of you have ended this already, or you're about to. Anything else here? I'm not gonna make this long. It came back out though, the Three of Wands. The Empress, <laughs> the Hierophant here. Somebody was trying to get you in some fucking legal trouble here. Was stealing with this four of pentacles. For some of you, because and then we got the tower right here again. With the fool, with the will of fortune this time. <laughs> but for a lot of you... <laughs> This was coming in. Some of you know, some of you don't know. The moon right here, and it's out here already. Whatever you've been working on within yourself, holding back, <laughs> pulling back your energy here, really seeing shit here, Somebody, somebody's being watched. I just heard talk of the town. You and your person going to be the talk of the town. And this individual here with this orphaned energy, they're going to be the talk of the town. But everybody is going to know. <laughs> they going to be like, fuck, I knew that shit. I knew that motherfucker wasn't shit. For some of you, it's a Taurus. And whoever they married to, or in the um a same a same belief marriage. Take it high resonate. This is why you gotta be careful. Justice coming in here. <laughs> Justice is coming in. Somebody thought it was... I'm telling you, somebody is going to be embarrassed through the courts. Somebody could have made you like an unfit mother as to why they left you out. But you got to ask the motherfucking question. If this was an unfit mother or an unfit father, why didn't you pick up the fucking slack? <laughs> why didn't you pick up the slack? Why didn't you just be that that mother or that father 
that you proclaim for the world to see, why didn't you do that shit for your own? Somebody getting in trouble for that shit. <clears throat> they getting in trouble. So, <laughs> somebody in some big legal shit that they was trying to hide from you. Somebody was trying to be the 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 fake Bonnie and Clyde shit, <laughs> and that shit ain't work. That shit ain't work. And this how they looking, real fucking childish and real goofy, <laughs> crying and shit. Well, so guys, I'm gonna end it there. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.